Vietnam, September 9, 2024. <laughs> Floods triggered by a strong have caused severe damage in Vietnam, threatening the country's northern regions that includes the electronics hub and the capital Hanoi. Heavy rains caused massive flooding and landslides in Lao Cai, Yen Bai, Thai Nguyen, and Sao Bang provinces on Monday, reports said. <laughs> In Vudo province, rescue operations were continuing after a steel bridge over the Ingrush Red River collapsed Monday morning. A report said 10 cars and truck along with two motorbikes fell into the river. Thousands of people in the city had been mobilized since Sunday night to build dikes and to evacuate vulnerable residents to safer areas. Rescue workers and civilians used soil-filled bags to barricade against the water. But due to the high water levels, inundations still happen in a certain neighborhoods. Không có dấu hiệu của nước rút đâu. Không rút tí nào luôn, chỉ có lên. The Thai Nguyen Steering Committee for Natural Disaster Prevention, Search and Rescue said 55 wards and communities in Thai Nguyen had been flooded, and 2,000 families had been evacuated. In Yenbai, water levels in the Red River rose quickly, inundating several areas in the capital city. Major streets like Tan Nain or Tren Hang Do were up to 2 meters underwater. Hundreds of personnel have been dispatched Sunday night to help evacuate people and their belongings. <laughs> The National Center for Hydrometeorological Forecasting on Monday said winds pattern from Typhoon Yagi had triggered downpours in several mountainous areas in the north from 7 p.m. Sunday to 3 a.m. Monday. Rain levels went to up to 256 mm in certain locations. The Lao Kao Hydrometeorological Station said floods are expected to be rising quickly in rivers and streams of Lao Kai. Several roads in the city have been flooded by over half a meter, preventing vehicles from moving. By 10 a.m., authorities had mobilized forced to evacuate 72 families in Duyen Hai and Bin Min Words, as well as barricading flooded areas. Soil and trees stumbled down the National Highway 40, paralyzing traffic in Lao Cai on Monday morning. The Lao Cai People's Committee had issued an emergency situation regarding natural disaster to respond to floods and erosions in the area. High rain levels are in the seabed throughout Lao Cai, with rain levels within 12 hours going up to 300 millimeters. In Langsam province, two people had been killed amid floods as of 7 a.m., according to the local steering committee for natural disaster prevention, search and rescue. Over 1,000 houses were flooded, and 5,200 people were evacuated.
People in that Kituan say that the water had risen since Sunday afternoon and receded slowly. The water rose nearly to the second floor, with certain areas as high as a person's belly. There were power outages and rescue forces had been working all night to evacuate the people. <laughs> Nhà em phải ngập hủ với cả tủ lạnh.